from the Computer Museum in Mountain View, California. It's the Cube covering ACG Silicon Valley Grow Awards. Brought to you by ACG Silicon Valley. Hey, welcome back, everybody. Jeff Frick here with the Cube. We're at the ACGSV 14th Annual Grow Awards. About 300 people. It's their annual event to give out a couple innovation awards. We're excited to be here. It's our third year, and we're happy to have a board member on. He's Andy Armstrong, a partner at Singer Lee Walk. Andy, great to see you. Hey. Excited to be here. So you, you said you've been on the board for about a year. Yes. Why are you on the board? What is this organization about? Why are you excited to be part of it? So I actually, this last year has been incredible for me with my, in my affiliation with the group. Um, so the board, it's really, I, I was able to join so I could co-sponsor and lead the Young Accelerator program with Jim Chapman. And what we do is we take young startup companies and work with them. We create a panel of experts that is about you know five to six experts. And we sit down for two hour increments with these companies and really try to, to work out some of the issues that they might be beating their head against the wall. And we kind of help them try to jump over those hurdles that they're facing and take them to the next level. And, and how, how old are they generally when they're in this process in terms of number of employees or age or how, how, do, they, how do you put a bucket in it? Pretty young startup companies. I would say that some are pre-revenue. Others are, you know, they might have five to ten employees, and they're, you know, maybe have anywhere from pre-revenue to a million dollars worth of revenue, just kind of moving up the ladder, so to speak. Right, and they don't have to be a client of your guys to participate. Absolutely not. No, they just really we're looking for kind of open-minded executives that are really wanting to take advantage of and tap into some of the you know, the phenomenal executives that, that are part of uh, ACG as well as here in Silicon Valley. Right, and then you said your, your firm is also very involved in Southern California, so there's a number of chapters of ACG. Absolutely, there's chapters of ACG throughout the country. Um, like you said, we've, the president of ACG LA, for example, is one of my partners down in my firm in LA. Um, we, we also, my marketing director runs one of the largest ACG conferences in the country, which is down in LAA every September. So, right. yeah, we're heavily involved as a firm in ACG. So we're pretty tech focused up here. Obviously, we're in the Computer History Museum, but I'm curious in Southern California, what are some of the industries that you guys really help and leverage? You know, we, we work a lot with, um, down there, a lot of public companies. We're, we do a lot of public company audits. We also work with what we call our family on an entrepreneurially owned company. So, we, we like to say that's the lifeblood of Singer Lewak in terms of working with companies, again, big or small, mom and pop, but, but that's, that's really what the focus is down there. Right, so biggest surprise in working with some of these young entrepreneurs. It's always fun to, to you know, work with people that are getting started, they're so enthusiastic. What are some of the kind of surprises as you work through some of those sessions with them? You know, maybe not surprises, but just the realization of, of they're young. They're, they, they're hitting their head against the wall just like you and I do sometimes. And, right. and, and I think it's, it's fun to get into that environment in the accelerator because it, what, it's what I like to call a safe environment for them. It's not like they're coming in to pitch for an investment. They're coming in and kind of airing some dirty laundry and, and just kind of opening up and being honest with us. And that's where they get the most out of that program. Right, and I would imagine they get quite a bit also from their peers in that, in that environment as well. <laughs> Um, Maybe not. <laughs> yeah. Well, in terms of the peers, I, in terms of the peers that in our on our panel, absolutely. I don't right. know in terms of peers in terms of how much they're networking with with their competitors, so to speak. Right. Right. But yeah. They get it's phenomenal the experience that each one of these companies well, has. Competition's a big part of uh, what drives us up here <laughs> for sure. So you know, you can be a partner in one area, you can be a competitor in the other, and you know, there's so many places and so much opportunity in a lot of the growth areas as well. So there's a lot of absolutely. a lot of room to run. Yeah, absolutely. It's All right. great. Well, Andy, I give you the last word. What are you looking forward to tonight? You know, it's fun just to get into a room full of top executives, very successful uh, people here in the Bay Area, and just to, to get to kind of rub shoulders and meet and, and talk to them and, and just, you know, appreciate the success that ACG has had in, in working with, with these kind of people. Yeah, they bring in good ones for sure. Pat Gelsinger will be keynoting tonight. He's been on the Cube many times, really doing great things at VMware, so it should be a good yeah, evening. It's really exciting. All right, well, he's Andy Armstrong, I'm Jeff Frick. You're watching theCUBE from the 14th Annual ACGSV Awards. Thanks for watching.